my name is Duo Sinai from Rhythm Fusion in Santa Cruz, California. And in my hand, I have something that will bring a new dimension to global percussion, something that I call Zilzil. I'll tell you how it came about. A few years ago, I was lucky to go on a musical tour with Omar Farouk Tekbilek, which is one of my musical heroes. As a part of my equipment, I needed a cha-cha sound, something that sounds like jingly, something that demanded a whole different frame drum with cymbals on it. However, being a traveling musician at the time, it was very challenging to, to carry another drum. So I came back with this idea of a zilzil that will adopt my drum to a different drum. So for beginning, I'll show you how it starts. That's how it started, but then I needed this jingle sound and I added this symbol. And if you notice, I'll do it again. I just took the zilzil and with a little press, I put it on, slips on the frame of the drum and it transforms it to a whole new instrument. Listen to that. that amazing a whole new kind of sounds look at that these are different ways as I was working with it I pulled it out and I adapted it to fit where my other hand is and it fits to next to my fingers this is where I created a combination of a duff and a rick which I call the frick listen to that The Frick, huh? amazing. More than that, I was playing with it and I developed many different ways of playing different styles. So check this out, this is what I call a Hendrick and I just rest it on my thumb with the little tip on my palm and that way And Rick, isn't that amazing? I took two of them together and I created a shaker or a ganza sound. Check it out. Ganza, isn't that amazing? I want to show you some of the little details that's happening here because it's so simple and so innovative and so adjustable. The body is made of stainless steel and the tip is made of a rubber that has a metal end to it. And it's simply, with pushing and twisting, it fits on. More than that, I have control of the space. I could keep turning and pushing and create a very little space. That way, I have much tighter and control over the cymbals and a drier sound. Because it's so easy and it leaves so much space, I could create a combination of many kinds of sounds. I could add jingles, I could add shakers, I could add little bells. I'll show you that on the next one, but now to keep it simple, I would put two pairs of jingles and I put a stopper on and here I have a new instrument with a whole new sound. Listen to this. Isn't that amazing? Oh, I got so excited about it. And uh, you could get wild with it. I'll show you. While I'm putting this on, I want to tell you that you could keep in touch with us with rhythmfusion.com or check it out at zilzil.net. I hope to keep in touch with you. We share some good times 
and keep life alive. Check it out. I'm going to use these for my rick. I'm going to use these for another jingle or cha sound. And I'm going to add one of these just to be like a Mickey Mouse. Are you ready for that? 